palace we're after is in western Iraq. Syrian desert. There's a complication. Desert storm. Coalition forces launched the operation two weeks ago against Saddam Hussein. They've taken out as many strategic targets from the air as possible. They haven't destroyed the palace yet, but that's about to change. British SAS forces are on the ground hunting mobile Scud launchers, and they've marked our palace for massive aerial bombing. That can't happen. We don't know what Pantheon's hiding in the bunker under the palace. If it's destroyed, we lose the trail. I reached out to an old collaborator of mine at MI6 for a favor. She pressured the SAS to delay their airstrike, but it'll come at a cost. We're gonna pose as Delta Force operatives so this Helen Park can get us to the front. Then we're gonna help the SAS clean up those scud launchers. After that, the palace is ours. destroyed as much as you want that palace. We think the Iraqis could start launching at any time. Jackal Troop 1, let's smash those launchers. Moving to flank the first sight. All right, Park, keep those yanks of yours on a tight leash. Charming guy. There, he's got up. It's already happened. The site's still a quarter to ahead. Can you pick it up? Activity. and unload the trucks. Yes, sir. We're building our layup here. Your crew's not too shabby, Park. <laughs> now, let's see what else they've got. This will be our base of operations for now. Here, you won the straw vote and get to carry the tack map. We've got a lot of ground to cover, so you'll find it useful. We need to neutralize three more Scud sites. Stay alert out there. You might find other things of interest as well. Gladney's promised to help your team breach the palace if you destroy those Scuds. Help him out, and we'll see if he's a man of his word. You can talk to him yourself if you'd like. He'll stay here in the layup working logistics for the SAS. Once you're ready to head out, we'll follow your lead. Got no shortage of guns. Grab whatever gear you want. 
Need something? Might want some of that C4. Should've tear right through a scud launcher. So much interest in this palace. We'll if it was up to me, we'd have blown it to kingdom come by now. The only reason it's still standing is Miss Park over there. Interesting indeed. Yeah. Just help us take out the remaining scuds and we'll help you get whatever it is you need. Not at the moment. It's too many bloody surface-to-air missiles. In fact, I just received word that some of your Delta Force friends were shot down nearby. We have our own attack helo, but it's not getting up there unless you find some way to disable the SAM sites in this region. The Iraqis have a few new encampments, likely connected to these cross-border missile strikes. Intel reports several unusual forces embedded in the camps. I'm not sure what you should expect there. You're mostly on your own there. Command's made some supply drops in the area, but we haven't had a chance to retrieve them. If you find any, they're yours. I've sent Jackal 1 for the Scuds in Sectors 7, 8 and 9. The rest are yours. We put advanced scouts on the ground to find the sites, and they're still out there. If you meet any, they might have additional intel. Don't you Americans talk? Of course. But no one besides Park seems to know about your little pack. To be honest, I don't give a shit about your agenda, if we can get the work done out here. Let's hope they make short work of their targets. Don't worry. If all goes according to plan, they'll be back in time to help raid the palace. That is, if you uphold your end of the deal. What do you have in mind? Best of British to you out there. You've got a couple rovers available, Case. Take your pick. Case, if there's anything else you want to know about the mission, I'd speak to Gladney over there. We ready? Gunfire to the right. Over those dunes. Careful. This is Lieutenant Colonel Bannon of Delta Force. Requesting immediate backup. We're taking heavy fire at the helo. Down helo. American. They can use some help. Let's get in there. The day. Let's see how Bannon's holding up. Soldier, where the hell? Doesn't matter. I need you to call an airstrike. Terminal's inside the helo. Go! This is Diesel 2 1, approaching your position. Hold out until I get there. Airstrike's inbound. Stay alive till I get here.
one, approaching your position. Hold out until I get there. Airstrikes inbound. Stay alive until they get here. Armor's rolling in. Try to pass in. Until you showed up. Thank you. From one Delta unit to another. Keep the sack count. Godspeed. Uh. Carefully, 
Spotted an enemy camp in the dunes. Got eyes on Tango. Haven't spotted us yet. Mosey on. Man, these dudes go on forever. It appears your mystery group might be real after all, Adler. You don't trust me? Just as much as I need to. Don't act surprised. Gladney, spotted one of the SAM sites. Excellent. If you take those surface to air missiles off the board, we can get your helo support. Target mark. Clear now. If we destroy the other two, the Iraqis will lose aerial advantage in the region. We'll keep an eye out. Got eyes on another supply drop. Can't let him grab our stuff. Tango, take cover! Sticking around for tea. <laughs> Probably dreadful anyway. 
We're looking for a bunker. Our best guess is that we can access it on the far side of the ground. We'll see you through. After that, it's up to Talon 1 to lift us all out in one piece. That's my preference. So let's get to it then. We're nearly there. Look alive, people. They know we're coming. Fire at will! Adler, on me. We're going down. We'll hold the area. Be quick about it. Hostiles inside. One's hit. We're clear. Let's go. Let's 
better be it. Billy really make you work for it, don't they? Good God. Saddam's hoarding millions down here. Hell, this gold toilet's worth that much. And you trade it all for a WMT. We're close. Clear. What the hell happened in here? Biohazard cabinet. Must be the demonstration Alawi mentioned. How about that hard case there? Check it out. What do we got? The cradle. Panthing has a goddamn biological weapon. And they put this in Saddam's hands too? A sample of it. Based on what I'm seeing in here. What'd you find? A disc. Some notes, all in Russian. The project's headed by Matvi Gusev. Sounds like you know him. I recognize the name. Gusev was a scientist in the Soviet Union's biological weapons program, Biopreparat. Intelligence had him fleeing Russia last year. Then he vanished. Gusev gave the Pantheon a Soviet bioweapon? No. According to this, the cradle came from somewhere else. A research facility I'm familiar with. It's American. America. All right, visiting time's over, you three. We need your help up here. Head to top side. Let's move. You get what you wanted? Not exactly, but we got what we needed. We need to clear a pickup zone. Let's get to the palace rooftop. Let's go. Helo's incoming. Jackal 1-1, one, one. you got an enemy bird to the east. Tango's on the ground approaching your position. Copy that! Let's give them all the go!
Tiger 1, this is Talon 1. We'll have a quick clear position. Prepare for extraction. Talon 1, it's too hot. We got enemy halos in the air. Roger, maintaining distance. They keep coming. something. The Pantheon has a biological weapon. The papers we found in that bunker, they had a name attached. Matt V. Goosey, a Soviet weapons scientist. We think he's still in Iraq, somewhere. Adler's volunteered to stay behind and track his ass down. I'll have Felix examine the disc we found while the rest of us investigate the origin of the cradle. If Adler's right, this thing may have come from a research facility on U.S. soil. A Soviet scientist and an American bioweapon. What the hell are we getting into? You've asked Sarah about this supposed research facility. She's not picking up. I told her to look into Livingston. You think something's happened to her? To ask, it's my fault. The weight of the world on your shoulders. We know the risks. Yeah, well, this isn't exactly what I imagined. Because it's not just about you. How'd you feel about coming with me in case stay side? I'd consider it. Felix still in the kitchen. Don't complain. We ate well while you were off wandering the desert. <laughs> he should be decrypting the disc Adler found. We need whatever's on it. Hey, chef, you cracked that disc yet? <sighs> Patience, please. Cryptography is like preparing pufferfish. Rush through it and risk losing everything. Okay. Is he planning to serve us buffer fish? Hey, you said no complaining. I did, didn't I? Let me know when we're close to leaving. Yo, ask for help, man. Fuck you too. Fine, have fun. Does it look like I'm having fun? No, it's n that's not what I meant. You got dealt a bad hand. You're gonna get dealt bad hands, kid. With us, the stakes are high. To be honest, I don't think I could have done it. Come back home after what happened in Panama. 
trusted anyone again. You keep believing in the ones who got your back. Who go to battle for you. Adler was one of those. When those records turned up after Panama, the wire transfers to Adler from Raul Menendez, two-bit dope slinger. I smell bullshit. Adler turn against his brothers for cash. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Those threads he loves, they ain't cheap now. Listen, I know he can be a goddamn psychopath. I get it. But he's on our side. He just got his own way of doing things. <laughs> I don't know what the rules are anymore. <laughs> You're figuring it out, kid. Handling things, making calls. I just wish I was out there kicking ass with you. Kills me to be in this thing. Hold on now, you listen. You're essential, man. All right, chair or no chair. I know you can't get around the way you used to, but this, this is strong. Maybe you were, maybe you were Captain America before, and now, now you're like Professor X. Who? Get out of my face, man. <sighs> Adler believed the Pantheon gained access to a military research facility called Advanced Technologies and Applications. Sounds impressive. It's located in eastern Kentucky. The building is marked as cost for solutions on the surface. Underneath, it's a whole different story. This place looks pretty remote. Nothing but forests and hills. We should park a few miles out, hike the rest of the way in. Once we're inside, our target is the biotechnology wing. Adler thinks that's where the cradle may have come from. We need some answers on what this thing does. Didn't you say Adler worked there at some point? Briefly. About ten years ago. He mentioned unusual classified programs there using human subjects. And suddenly the place was shut down and quarantined after a biohazard incident. The cradle. It's sure looking that way. Seth, how's it going on your side? Still looking for a way in. The north doors are totally sealed. You? Case and I are in South Gate Utility Entrance. Looks like someone's been through here recently. Used a freight elevator. Chain's broken. All right, the mask's going. Your turn. Hang on up. years ago. Combat research. ACR employees 
on the mountain that authorized safety equipment must be run on the testing floor at all times. Case might be having calm issues. Ready to stop for a while now. Case, are you getting any of this?
Try another way. Look up. We're stronger and faster than the rest of these. That's what the cradle was originally designed to do. to take their reports to the director. Now it's up to us. Maybe he'll give us his keycard in return.
but the rest of them. of the Pantheon case. They were a CIA branch, unknown to even the other Black Ops divisions. They developed the Cradle. A new generation of operatives would be born of it. Director keycard required. Director keycard required. Evacuate. Director keycard accepted. Director keycard accepted. inside that bathysphere case.
Weapon switch locked. Drone switches one, two, and three are
only one key card left. The Cradle Project failed in this case. We were out of control, violent, maniacal. And in our rage, we sabotaged this facility. We contaminated it with the same poison that runs in our veins. Remember? Vector key card accepted. Sincerely apologize. Uh, just until we understand these recent behavioral changes. Safety is our top priority.
soul. Livingston doesn't go. Afterwards, we were rehabilitated. <laughs>
Case! Case! It's me. It's Marshall. I think he's coming too. It's gonna be okay. Whatever trip you've been on, I'm glad I wasn't invited. Easy on your feet. Can't believe you even made it up here. Case, we have something. Check it out. Someone took a large batch of whatever this stuff is. Last summer, by the looks of it. The Pantheon. This must be the crater. What is it? A hallucinogen? Seems so. In case you were ready to tear us both apart. Never seen that look in your eyes before. Hope we don't see it again. Let's get the hell out of here. Hey, something you should see. No popcorn? I'm serious. Well, you got my attention. <laughs> you cracked the disc. Indeed. No, no, no. You must make sure that... Yes, you have it. Ready, Dr. Gusev? Bring her in. This subject 18 has been infected with the cradle. She's now in proximity to our control subject. Transmission should occur momentarily. It's a biological weapon. You know this already. Keep watching. Faster this time? Faster, yes. And more aggressive, as requested. Wonderful. Isn't that your friend? Harold? You did that. Apparently so. Turn it off. I said a few more moments. I said turn it off! 